In this podcast episode, Dr. Mark Hyman interviews Dr. Casey Means, a physician who transitioned from traditional to functional medicine. They explore the detrimental impact of the food industry on public health and the alarming decline in lifespan. Dr. Means emphasizes the importance of high-quality unprocessed food from nutrient-rich soil for optimal health. She discusses how providing the body with the right nutrients supports cellular health and prevents illness. They both reflect on their medical training, revealing how they began to question the conventional medical system and its fundamental flaws. The conversation highlights metabolic health as the root cause of many chronic diseases, including diabetes, heart disease, cancer, and Alzheimer's. Dr. Means explains that metabolic dysfunction, particularly insulin resistance, results in underpowered cells and a host of health issues. She points out that 93% of American adults have poor metabolic health, indicating a widespread problem that needs urgent attention. They critique the healthcare system for failing to prioritize health and disease prevention. They discuss the profit-driven nature of the industry, where financial incentives favor treating symptoms over addressing root causes. The food industry exacerbates this issue by promoting ultra-processed foods that contribute to metabolic dysfunction and chronic illness. Dr. Means shares her experience of being discouraged from discussing diet and lifestyle changes with patients during her surgical residency, highlighting the system's preference for procedures over holistic health approaches. They also discuss the influence of pharmaceutical and food industries on research, education, and professional associations. The corporate capture of these industries has led to a distorted view of health and nutrition, with funding sources shaping the information promoted within the system. Dr. Means and Dr. Hyman explore the concept of good energy linked to mitochondrial health. Good energy involves meeting the basic needs of our cells and avoiding harmful substances. They stress the importance of key biomarkers, fasting glucose, triglycerides, HDL cholesterol, blood pressure, and waist circumference in assessing metabolic health and mitochondrial function. These biomarkers can indicate metabolic dysfunction and ultimately impact overall health and lifespan. The conversation shifts to the limitations of traditional medicine in addressing metabolic issues and the need for individuals to take control of their health. Dr. Means encourages listeners to trust themselves and their bodies, advocating for democratizing healthcare and empowering individuals to understand their health data through tools like continuous glucose monitors and comprehensive lab tests. Dr. Hyman and Dr. Means discuss the importance individuals conducting experiments on themselves to determine what works best for their unique biology. They highlight the role of environmental toxins in driving insulin resistance and metabolic dysfunction, emphasizing the need to detoxify the body to improve health outcomes. Dr. Means shares a patient's success story in regulating blood sugar through a cellular detoxification regimen, showcasing the power of personalized interventions based on individual biomarkers. Dr. Means discusses the importance of making informed choices about what we eat to support metabolic health and overall well-being. She highlights the significance of consuming fiber, antioxidants, healthy proteins, omega-3 fats, and probiotics to nourish our bodies and promote good energy. She encourages people to view food as medicine and to prioritize high-quality, unprocessed foods from sources like farmers markets to support their health. The conversation shifts to the interconnected nature of our bodies with the environment, emphasizing that we are constantly exchanging matter and energy with the world around us. Dr. Means challenges the prevailing mindset of individualism and separation, advocating for a deeper understanding of our interconnectedness with the soil, air, water, sunlight, and food. She urges individuals to recognize their role in shaping their health and the environment by making conscious choices about the food they consume and supporting sustainable practices. Dr. Means and Dr. Hyman discuss systemic issues within the food industry, including the influence of pharmaceutical and food companies on mainstream media and government agencies. They highlight the need to address conflicts of interest and lobbying efforts that prioritize profit over public health. Dr. Means calls for policy changes, such as incentivizing the production of nutrient-dense foods 
removing added sugars from school lunch programs, and reducing industry influence on regulatory bodies like the FDA and USDA. The conversation touches on the importance of research funding and the potential savings in healthcare costs by investing in preventative measures like promoting healthy diets. Dr. Means emphasizes the need for a shift away from relying solely on evidence-based medicine towards a more holistic approach that considers individual health and well-being. She stresses the power of individuals to advocate for change through informed decision-making, engagement with policymakers, and support for initiatives that prioritize public health over corporate interests.